How to do hand stretches for carpal tunnel syndrome. The carpal tunnel is a rigid and narrow passageway for bones and ligaments that houses the median nerve and tendons. When the median nerve in the carpal tunnel is compressed and the tendons are irritated and swollen, carpal tunnel syndrome occurs. Symptoms of carpal tunnel syndrome include numbness or tingling in the hand and fingers, which may extend from the wrist up the arm as the condition progresses. Stretching exercises can ease irritation of the carpal tunnel by increasing blood flow, relaxing the muscles and tendons, and suppressing the symptoms to help you regain normal hand movement. Stretches are not a substitute for proper treatment, so you should always talk to your doctor. Trying some wrist stretches. Do the prayer stretch. Stretches alone will not resolve an issue you have with carpal tunnel, but combined with effective treatments, they can help you to relieve moderate symptoms. The prayer stretch can help you to increase blood flow to the median nerve. Try the prayer stretch for early relief of carpal tunnel pain, and to reduce sensations of numbness and tingling. Begin with your palms pressed together in front of your chest, below your chin. Slowly lower your hands still pressed together downwards, keeping them close to the stomach. When you feel a moderate stretch, hold this position for 15 to 30 seconds. Repeat 2 to 4 times. The stretch should cause no pain. If you feel an increase in pain or numbness and tingling in your hands, then stop the exercise and see your doctor or physical therapist. Begin with your palms pressed together in front of your chest, below your chin, slowly lower your hands still pressed together downwards, keeping them close to the stomach. When you feel a moderate stretch, hold this position for 15 to 30 seconds, repeat 2 to 4 times. The stretch should cause no pain. If you feel an increase in pain or numbness and tingling in your hands, then stop the exercise and see your doctor or physical therapist. Stretch the wrist flexor. Stretching your wrist flexor might help. Start by extending one arm forward, parallel to the floor with the palm facing the ceiling. With the other hand, bend the fingers down towards the floor. When a stretch is felt, hold for 15 to 30 seconds, switch arms and repeat 2 to 4 times. If it is not possible for you to straighten your arm out, then you can also do this stretch with your elbows slightly bent. Stretch the wrist extensor. Extend one arm forward, parallel to the floor with your palm facing the floor. With the other hand, bend your fingers down towards the floor. When a stretch is felt, hold for 15 to 30 seconds, switch arms and repeat 2 to 4 times. If it is not possible for you to straighten your arm out, then you can also do this stretch with your elbows slightly bent. Do wrist circles. Wrist circles can help you to decrease tension in the fingers and flexor tendons. Clench your fists then release the index and middle fingers, pointing them straight. With the two fingers draw five circles in a clockwise direction, then another five circles in a counterclockwise direction, alternate hands, but repeat three times with each hand. Squeeze a ball in the palm of your hand. Squeeze a tennis ball or something similar to help you to increase mobility of the entire wrist. Using a pressure or stress ball can help alleviate carpal tunnel pain as well as provide stress relief. Gently squeeze the ball for 5 seconds and then release. Then switch to your other hand, and continue alternating. If you don't have something to squeeze, make a fist and hold it for 5 seconds. Release, and then repeat 5 times. Switch to the other hand and repeat. If a tennis ball is too difficult to squeeze, then try squeezing a soft stress ball or even some clay. Gently squeeze the ball for 5 seconds and then release, then switch to your other hand, and continue alternating. If you don't have something to squeeze, make a fist and hold it for 5 seconds, release, and then repeat 5 times, switch to the other hand and repeat. If a tennis ball is too difficult to squeeze, then try squeezing a soft stress ball or even some clay. Do weighted wrist curls. You can help strengthen your wrists and potentially release tension by performing some weighted wrist curls. Take a light weight, a can of food is good to start with, and hold it in one hand. Hang your hand over the edge of a surface, such as a bench, table or your lap. Your palm should be facing down. Make sure that your forearm is supported. Then slowly curl your wrist up, hold it for a moment and then slowly bring it back down. Repeat this for 10 repetitions, then turn your arm over so your palm is facing the sky, and do 10 more repetitions. You can also use a resistance band in a similar manner. Place your forearm on a surface, such as a bench, table, or your lap, but allow your hand to hang over the edge of the surface. Then, place the other end of the resistance band on the floor and secure it under your foot. Then, complete the curls. You can adjust the tension on the elastic band by increasing or decreasing the length of the band. 